It's called Operation Stack for a reason. From first light this morning, 33 miles of the M20 was turned into a lorry park. The eastbound carriageway can hold up to 3,000 vehicles. There are 945 and counting. I need to go home. Christmas. Christmas. Who knows? Maybe we make Christmas here. I don't know. It's a gross problem. It's a catastrophe. In the queues, the council handed out water and snacks to drivers, but what was given with one hand was taken back with another. Traffic from France was flowing, but not as normal. Port of Dover was expecting 4,000 lorries today. Less than half that number arrived. Dover's chief executive said he was surprised freight was included in the travel ban. During the initial lockdown, uh, the lorry drivers have been exempt because it was determined how important it is to make certain that the traffic continues to flow. This is COVID, of course, but it's Brexit too, isn't it? Uh, I... I don't know. You'd have to, other people could comment upon that. A strawberry lasts around nine days after it's picked. It usually takes up to five days to transport strawberries from, say, the south of Spain to the supermarket shelves in the UK. So a delay of a few days either reduces the shelf life of strawberries or it can make them completely unsellable. As do in all the other supermarkets insist, you can shop with confidence. Your Christmas dinner is safe. But if the disruption stretches into Wednesday, it may create supply problems. Tonight, the French are insisting on a stricter testing regime for drivers than the British government is willing to accept. The PCR is the gold standard of tests. Why do you say it won't work? But practically, the PCR you know, uh, solution takes at least 24 hours to get the results back. You know, we've got drivers in queues there today, potentially tomorrow as this builds and this continues. So you think a PCR test will mean queues? Absolutely, yeah, of course it's going to mean queues. How much longer can this go on? How urgently does this need to be resolved? We need this resolving tonight. We need it, you know, at the very latest tomorrow. If we spin into, you know, Wednesday, Thursday, you know, we're going to have some significant impacts on our supply chain. Tonight, the M20 continues to stack. The UK imports more across the channel than it exports. One third of these lorries are returning empty. They all contain drivers hoping to make it home for Christmas. Joel Hills, News at 10 in Dover.